Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Teamstar and today I'm going to show you a little something I've been working on lately. Basically, it's a JREGME 4.0, which may or may not work for 32-bit ID devices running iOS 9.1 up to iOS 9.3.4. Um, seriously, I've only tested this on my iPhone 4S running iOS 9.3.1. Um, it might work on other devices, but if it doesn't, please don't bother try to getting this work. Um, use Home Depot instead, which has been out for a while and works pretty well. Um, it basically does the same, just with an app instead of a JRegMe. So, this was a fun project and I just thought a JRegMe 4.0 would be cool to revive the old JRegMe. And yeah, as already mentioned, it has no practical use because Home Depot already exists. So if you just want to get a jailbreak and this doesn't work, just use Home Depot instead. Anyways, let's get started. So I can show you this is an iPhone 4S on iOS 9.3.1. Uh, now it works for this version. It might work for uh, other 32-bit devices running those versions too might not basically what you want to do is you go to jailbreak dot me okay uh, I'm gonna reload this page just to be sure okay so this seems to work well yeah there's basically just one button jailbreak me um, before I hit that, I'm gonna show you there's the hashes of the um, files which I use if you want to check that. You can also download the index HTML and verify its PGP signature. Um, don't need to do this. Basically, you just press JREG me. And the JREG consists of five stages, I think. Like, first stage is downloading resources. The second stage is downloading Cydia, which will probably be the longest stage. Then we have the stage one exploit, which is the JavaScript exploit. Then the stage two exploit, which does the kernel exploit and the installing Cydia. It, um, is the, the, it should run pretty quickly. Um, on, the, on the first install, it like uh, takes a while to extract the uh, Cydia tar and stuff like that. And this is a tethered jailbreak, so technically you need to re-jailbreak it after reboot. However, you can use uh, Untether Home Depot, which can be found on my Cydia repo, to make this a fully untethered jailbreak. I'm going to show you how to do this in this video. So um, let's wait a moment until stage 2 exploit is done and Cydia is installed. Oh, here it goes. That was pretty quick, actually. So after it's done, the device respring's. So now we can unlock it, and we should see City on the second page. So let's go ahead and open that. And let's see, we can cancel this or wait until it's done. Basically, now we're gonna add repo dot team star dot net. Whoops. So let's go back to Cydia. We can ignore that or you should update all these files. Gonna go to system and install community offsets, which will install the um, offsets gathered by the community as well as the Untether Home Depot uh, package. 
So make sure to actually install both of them. And now the device is fully, fully untethered jailbroken. So I can also show this here, 41931 Cydia. And I can also turn it off. And turn it back on. So let's unlock it here and go to Cydia and you can see Cydia works which means the device is in jailbroken state. So yeah, now you have a fully untethered jailbroken iOS 9.3.1 or whatever the iOS it works for you. Um, that's about it and I hope you enjoy it.